Well, I'm Candace, and this is Seppi. And we, we love One Tree, Tree Hill! Hill. <laughs> it's totally our favorite show. We always get too involved in how Lucas is cheating on Brooke, and why he just wants to admit he has feelings for Peyton. Anywho, me and Cadence, while well, always after school every day, we go home to each other's house and we watch One Tree Hill on Netflix! Okay, so the other day, Steffi comes up to my locker and asks me if she wants to come over and watch One Tree Hill. And I said okay. And I said okay. And I said okay. And I said okay. And we said okay, 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 okay! <laughs> well, yeah, me and, oh, I got there and so we're already half of my house and we both get really, really, really hungry. Yeah, my stomach was like totally growling, so I asked her if she wanted to find something to eat. And I said okay. And I said okay. And then I said okay. And I said okay. And then we said okay, 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 okay. 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 Well, we're looking around the kitchen for some grub. Like, I was so hungry. Did you guys ever feel so hungry that you really need to eat something right away? No. Oh, and pain was in my stomach. I was so hungry. And well, I mean like, I went, and I was like, oh Mother Hubbard, the cupboard was bare! Finally, Stephanie found a can of Beanie Weenies. She's all trying to get me to eat them, and I'm all like, Beanie Weenies? Sounds so gross. I mean, beans and weenies in a can? Ew. Well, anywho, so she finally agreed to eat them, so we nuked them in the microwave, you know, be, be, be. And finally, we both sat down to finish watching One Tree Hill! And, and in walks my brother Brad. He's such a brat. And he's all like, freaking out, yelling, you're eating my beanie weenies, you're eating my beanie weenies. <laughs> so my brother Brad, look, he looks such like a dork, he's so dorky. And he's like screaming about his beanie weenies. And then Cadence did this something really disgusting, it was so gross. That was totally not my fault at all, and you know that. I was just laughing so hard that I, that I shot a baby right out of my nose. <laughs> and Brad and I, we were just like standing there looking at her like, in total shock. And she's got like beanie juice running out her nose and like all over her face. Yeah, and if you think it smells bad coming out of here, you smell out of here. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Anywho, so naturally I excuse myself to the bathroom to blow my nose. And while I'm there, I hear a car pull up. It's my boyfriend, Kirk! <laughs> yeah, the jerk. I mean, he's always telling me we're not all of that, and he's all this, and you better do what he says. <laughs> Stephanie totally knows how I t uh, feel about their relationship, and even though I never push my thoughts on her, I just always tell her I'm there for her and I'm praying for her. So Cadence was there for like quite a while, but then she kind of stuck her head out the door and gave me this beanie's gone sign, you know, like, Kaka, Kaka! <laughs> I just sat back down on the couch to wait. Then I saw a bowl of beanie weenies and thought, I don't think so, and set them aside. <laughs> Finally, Steffi came back in, and you could tell she'd been crying. So I looked right at Cadence in the eye, with all my mascara just like running down my face, and I said, Cadence, tell me about Jesus! I totally wasn't expecting that. But I pulled myself together, gave her a tissue and the mascara out of my purse, and said that he was a guy who lived a long time ago and he wore long robes and American Eagle sandals. And I was like, no, I'm serious! <laughs> and I said, it's serious. SERIOUS! So I told her everything I knew about Jesus, and I asked her if she wanted to become a Christian. And I said, no, no, no. I mean, I just don't know if I'm ready. I really don't understand, like, what it all means. Besides, my mascara made me look like a reject from the metal bands that Zach listens to. And, and, and well, to talk to Jesus looking like this? I was like, tear. <laughs> well, anywho, the next day at school, I run up to Cadence, and I'm like, guess what? And I was like, what? And I'm like, guess what? And I was like, what? And I'm like, guess what? I was like, just shut up and tell me. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'll tell you. And I looked her right in the eye, and I told her, last night, I was in my room, and I prayed, and I told God I wanted to follow Jesus. I mean, it's so great. Before I went to sleep that night, I was praying, and I was like, God. I just wanted you to know that I'm here and you can use me however you choose. And I want to be like you. And I'm open and stuff. And, and I want to do whatever you want me to do, God. And God said, okay. And obviously I said, okay. And then God said, okay. And then we said, okay, okay, okay. And then I said, P.S. God, next time, can we just leave the beanie weenies all out of it? And that's the end of the story. Bye. Bye. We got to go watch One Tree Hill. One Tree Hill. That's my favorite. Oh, Lucas. No way. Nathan's better. Oh, uh, definitely Lucas.
Okay, skills is obviously better than that. I want me some chocolate. <gasps> Let's go! My tree now! <laughs> No, they do physical work and everything. He totally wears a proper